families are spending a lot more time at home, and a lot of kids are turning to some vintage toys to spend their time. Well, Frank Thiessen is the president of Carrera of America to tell us more about their slot cars and the importance of spending time with your family. Frank, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I think I'm great. Hey, you know, you've got a wonderful display behind you. This might be bring back some nostalgia for a lot of parents out there who have been playing with your cars because Carrera has been around for over five decades. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yeah, Carrera was founded uh, over in Germany in uh, 1963, actually, uh, and started the whole slot car business then and uh, is going strong ever since. And a lot of parents, grandparents have very fond memories playing with our slot car sets. And uh, now we have seen in the last couple of years, but especially now since last year, that they're getting back into it. They're remembering how much fun they had and they're introducing their kids, their grandkids to it. And it's really great to see that coming back, especially, of course, for us for our business, but also for me personally, because I am a lifelong Carrera kid. I got my first Carrera set when I was 10 years old. And I, I, I'm just getting now with this job, getting paid for having fun. <laughs> hey, nothing, nothing wrong with that. A lot of folks too are looking for different ways to unplug and get their kids away from the screens. The slot cars are a perfect way to do that. How do they work for those who, who might be unfamiliar with the slot cars? Oh, maybe I'm just quickly reach out so that is basically a slot car track you have these two track pieces here and then you get your car which has a little guide keel underneath it's slotted in and then you have a controller and you race you race around your track and you can build your track to whatever you want to be it how long it want you have you want to be it and uh, yeah, we have all kinds of, of cars available. So if it is uh, uh, what the kids know from their licenses, you can see behind me. So we have Mario, we have yeah. uh, the Disney cars, we have Paw Patrol, but we also have real car licenses. We have all the Ferraris, Lamborghinis, Ford Mustangs, Dodge Chargers, BMWs, whatever you want, whatever you're a fan of, you can get it. I'm so glad you said Paw Patrol because my son loves those characters. So if there's another Paw Patrol toy that we can get in the house, <laughs> I'm all for it, especially if it pulls them away from the screen, like I said. And this is all part of that resurgence that we're seeing of, of vintage, nostalgic toys kind of coming back. Yeah, definitely. And then there's, there's nothing wrong with a video game. That's fine. And, and mm -hmm. uh, most of us parents or me as a grandparent, we of course we want to restrict the time that the kids uh, spend in front of the screen, but I also play a video game. I have no problem with that. I like that. And I like to have a racing game on my video screen. Also good, but there's nothing which beats really the physicality and the real experience of seeing your car running around your slot car track. And it also has an added experience because yeah, your car will fly off the track at one point. So you have to raise up you have to get up and then you have to get that car back and put it on so that you can continue to race. And you're going to share some laughs and share some memories. That's really what it's all about, of spending that family time and, and trying to see those silver linings, taking advantage of that extra time that we're spending at home. Yeah, and we, we really see that, that it's, it's, it's across generations. So you have the, the grandparents and I don't really want to avoid to say granddad because we see also a lot of grandmas and a lot mm -hmm. of mothers and sisters playing with uh, these. So, and and uh, that, that is nothing which is just for boys. Girls and women love to waste and they're also mm -hmm. competitive and they're also skilled. <laughs> it, it always is, is, is determined as a boy's toy. No, it's not. It's for everyone. It's for yeah. everyone who enjoys racing and for everyone who enjoys fun. And for everyone of, of any age, as you mentioned, too. Thank you so much for bringing back a little nostalgia to us this morning, Frank. Thanks for having me. Much appreciated. And we're going to put a link up on our site so we can get some of those cars. Just head on over to roadshow.com.